Hello and welcome, I'm Marumba. Thank you for joining me. Let's play some more Switch Lake in Europe Universe House 4. We're going to continue to build up infantry because we're poor, and because we have loans, and because we have infantry combat ability. So, the way I figure, our infantry are going to be good. It's going to be what we want. We have uh, five loans. We owe quite a bit of money. 130 ducats. But, good news is, for a couple more years here, we're going to be making some ducats, even though we're at full army size. And uh, we're doing fantastic on Monarch Points. We're going to be ready for tech here very soon. Excellent leader for the moment. He's probably going to die soon, but you know, hopefully not right this second. And yeah, your reasons for allying me are down. But actually, if you didn't have the too many diplomatic relations, again, it's practically within range. It's close. Ottomans are going to finish up Byzantium. Good for them. Surprised it's taken some, them so long. One thing I might want to do is, um... You know, maybe even try to go up to level 2. Because again, Republican tradition is going to get lower and lower. Milan's declared on Genoa. Okay, are you going to... You're not going to call me in? Good. I don't want to join your war anyway. Your war is dumb. Very, very soon. The Platinet will see land to Alsace, who is the vassal of Austria. So Austria has expanded, but they're not doing it the normal route. They're, they're doing vassalization. Just curious. We could probably afford to mothball our fort right now. We're already at 19 army tradition. And we have we don't have enough to actually keep it up. Um, yeah, I'm thinking we're gonna mothball it. I'd like to get our loans paid off here, if we can. Besides, we're gonna continue to hopefully have this general. Well, he's not very good, but we're gonna continue to hopefully have good generals from here. We can do this again in 54. So if we need a better general, we'll we'll just try again with that. Austria. I don't already have a powerful ally. France is not very strong, trust me. He's weak. Okay, uh, do we want to lose papal influence, gain stability, or gain a little bit of money and lose money for 20 years? Oh man, I wish we already had a little bit more papal influence. Because then we could just spend it. <laughs> Send an emissary to Rome? No. Damn. I mean, I love that stability. I don't think we're going to be able to get the alliance with um, Austria right now, even if we get the Legate. And if I don't get the Legate, there's nothing else that I really want to spend points on right now. So, I think we ignore the Papal Influence. I'm thinking, I'm leaning towards the stability. So we lose loyalty on the nobility. Not a big deal. No penalty there. We gain loyalty on the clergy. Which is good, because we get more Papal Influence. Sure. We'll take our stability bump. Thank you. Thank you, thank you very much. Appreciate it, game. Thank you. I mean... I hate losing 20 stability or 20 papal influence, but you know, we'll take it. Bohemia has refused. They always refuse. Why are you surprised? Our cheapest loan is 27 ducats. 26 ducats. About to finish our mission. Really just kind of waiting on this truce now. Prove our prestige. Our manpower reserve needs to cover. Probably not going to happen. We'll go for the free stability because that's a great, great bonus to get when you're already at two stability. I don't care about you anymore. Let's improve relations with Milan a little bit, I guess. 
Our alliance with France is pretty secure with 157. We've already built up one favor. We have six favors with Milan. Those are the only two relationships that I have right now. Who else hates Burgundy? Denmark does. That's it. England doesn't hate Burgundy. Who the hell does England hate? Denmark, Aragon. Right, because you're going to attack Aragon. Brilliant. The logic needs to be improved there. Okay, truce is up in October of next year. One year to go. Uh, assuming France doesn't declare his own war, we can be the puppet master. Force France to do what we want. Oh no, there goes our good guy. That's unfortunate. Let's not let him die for a while. <laughs> I'd like a few more monarch points, please. I mean, I'll vote someone in eventually. Like, let's just see if this works. 12, 8, 10. It should work. Yeah, totally works. I mean, I'll vote for this top guy eventually. I just, I really like these extra military points we're getting right now. Thank you. That's a lot. You, you want me to join your war now? Why'd you wait so long? Okay, so... Allied in a war together. Luck is on your side. I mean, I'll join, sure. I just think it's kind of weird that you're doing it now. Let's wait till January the 1st. Get our morale tick. And then we'll hire our guy just to stop being so, you know, weird about it, but... Um, and he's okay. How old are you? 46? That's not that young. He's pretty young. I usually like to get him in their, thir in their 30s. Not bad, he's actually better than our current guy. Hopefully I can go down there and insta-squish that without taking any losses. Nope, he actually got a second troop there, in time. But, I'm not the one tanking the bite, so... No losses on my side. Okay, um... I kind of prefer to not do this. Here. No, we do need nine troops. We'll send the bare minimum over there. And if you're going to attach to me... Or don't attach here. You are providing me with... Uh, seven regiments. We're going to strip off most of our troops here. Just waiting on October now. And in the meantime, I guess I will fabricate on Savoy, even though I don't expect we're going to be able to take this province without the unlawful territory request. I could maybe try to piggyback, piggyback a war. Somehow. I don't know who that would be against. I mean, the truce with, with you is going to be up fairly soon. October of a year extra away. So we could always piggyback a war in with Venice. Or Savoy. No, truce is way longer with Savoy. We're about to get our idea group unlocked. Which means we get our first five year pulse event. Hopefully it's a positive one. We need to be ready for this war up here. So I'm going to leave behind just one regiment for the siege guy, but I don't actually want to be in charge of the siege. Milan has a siege guy as well, so I'm out. I don't care, I'm not participating.
We can call you in on favors. We still have the truce. Milan is not able to defend. Or not, sorry, not able to join. Which is fine. We're not counting on him. We're just counting on France to beat Burgundy. I'm pretty sure that's a safe bet, right? Burgundy, 21,000 troops. I see 20, 38. So 20, 11, probably another 15 to 20 between his unions. It'd be a close fight, actually. Who else hates Burgundy? Someone's got to hate Burgundy. Austria does, of course. Dude, Austria, be my buddy. Come on. I'm so strong. Just so you know. You should totally be my ally. Like, seriously, for real. What is our mission right now? 20%? 50%? This is going to be a, be a little while on that mission. Well, do we just declare the war anyway and hope that France does a good job? That's silly, right? I mean... Ooh, Crimea just took over everything over there. He's still got this province here. Obviously, the Ottomans are going to take that soon. Um, that is not... Nothing, nothing's occupied by me. I can't get down there. There goes our truce. I don't know. Alliance offer from Württemberg. Mantua will be forced to give Milan 10% of income. 90 ducats. Switzerland will get 11 ducats. Cool. Thanks for the ducats. Appreciate the ducats. Genoa will cede Genoa to Milan. Genoa will be forced to give Milan 10% of their income. They will pay 30 ducats. I get 3 ducats. I gained 1.3 prestige. Yay! And 7 favors. And is this Empire land? I believe it is. Yes. So, you are most definitely going to get unlawful territory on that province. Do we want to lose a whole bunch of stuff, or just have the clergy gain influence? Sure. Not scared of the clergy, are you? An alliance offer from Wartenberg. I mean, why do I care about you? I don't- I don't care about you. I'm sorry. Let's get our five-year pulse event. Innovative, go! Hopefully we get wave of inno wave of innovation. Milan has rivaled Savoy. I read that as Switzerland at first, and it freaked me out. I was about to get all pissed. You know, rage-induced. I feel like we just have to attack Burgundy, right? We just have to. There's the... yep, expected that. I mean, I could fabricate on Brescia. Unfortunately, that's a Milanese core, so if I take that, Milan's probably not going to be want to be buddies anymore. But I'd love to take these three provinces, all the way down to Parma as well. At some point. Again, we're expanding in the wrong direction. We're supposed to be expanding north. But, this Austrian jerk completely blocked me off. So what am I going to do, you know? I'm not going to just not attack. We could totally call Milan into the war. That might be enough to break it, to, to, to do it. Let's go for it. So we're calling Milan in on favors, and, uh... Yeah, I like this. France's troops are not in position to, to be able to do this. I think there might be something there. Ah, let's go for it. We're gonna wait a second, see what France sees. Once he gets to, like, Nemours, we'll see if there's an army there. Yep, as expected. That's why I don't want to march in there. I want to let him do the first fight. Okay, we'll move in. We will... Probably be, want to be the one that takes the siege of... Borgogoni. We can completely ignore this fort and go participate in that fight, which we will. But I need to get my two claims. I need Savoy and French Comte. I'm almost positive France is going to be interested in Savoy. Yep, 
Okay, we gotta be the one on that siege now. Good fight. Flat terrain, 10 versus 7. I don't really want to be the frontline guy here, but... Part of that army is going to be gone on the 6th, and I won't be there till the 9th. So it's going to be pretty significantly... Yeah, just me versus Brabant with a 0 0 0 3. I'll start the fight. I mean, he's going to reinforce. We'll both be there at the same time. But I'm the frontliner, apparently. My infantry combat ability. Thank you for your general, your 3 3. We appreciate that guy. Nice stack wipe. Only lost a little bit of manpower. Okay, from here, I'd like to be the one that starts the siege on the capital. So we'll get in position on that, and then if I can, we'll take the time to march around to Charolais. Or actually, you know what? You can come up to Charolais. Okay, so that's a good start. Um, should probably keep relations high with you and get back to improving with the Pope. We'll go throw our support into this fight, even though it's going to be completely unnecessary. We're totally, totally over, overdoing the front line right now. But I believe we're earning participation just for being in the battles. Whether or not we're actually engaging them, I, I don't really know. Never really did figure out exactly how that's calculated. Oh, that's not good. We're about to get squished on the first. Well, rats. My bad. My desire to have that there. Not working out. Now he's coming for me in the plains. And again, we're stuck. France, dude, you've got too many troops there. Could you come fight Burgundy? Burgundy's here. Just so you know, Burgundy's down here. Ugh. Oh. Oh my god, I rolled so bad. Stop rolling ones. I don't even think we can hold out for a week. Oh, thank goodness he rolled a zero. We'll make it. We'll make it. I'm going to retreat from this fight. My army needs out. We need to reinforce. You take over, France. Good luck. No, not these. No. Um. Not this one in particular, that's the main one that I care about. We can afford one Merc. It's not that expensive, relax. Truce with Venice is up. I think we just lost our war reps. No, nope, we got those for another few years. Excellent. Okay, I guess we are going to try to be here. Okay, I'll take your can. I'll take the cav. What are you doing? Double cav. Are you baiting me? You seem to be trying to bait me. Get me out of here. Quickly. Okay, Burgundy's on the run. We got this, don't worry. Provence is now declared on Brittany. Okay. Hopefully he's able to get military access. What's your situation with France? You have a CB. France is neutral. Okay, so he's going to give him access. No! 
Don't tell me you just gave up that breach wall siege in Nevers. All to go fight this army up here. Oh my god, you did do it. You did it. You already had the siege done. France. Being a loser. I lent some support. I'm trying. I'm trying to help. I'm a nice guy. Austria's got a personal union over Hungary. That's pretty common. This is what I'm scared of: is that he's gonna like these these damn forts gonna keep on returning territory, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna lose track of it, and then out of nowhere, France is gonna get the occupation, and he's not gonna give it to me because he desires this land. I have to have at least at least this one, preferably both of these, so that I can take two provinces. I highly doubt we're going to be able to take three. I'd have to be the siege leader on Bourgogne, and, uh... I'm not so sure that's going to happen. I will be there... the day behind you. We are the defender, though. Yeah, France is the leader of this siege. Yep, I had a feeling he was going to... I just... You know? What can you do? Relative strength of the alliance is clearly in our favor, but uh, still having some issues. We don't want this war to go too high because the Burgundian inheritance could fire and that'd be bad for me. Because then I wouldn't get like any of this. And the Emperor's not in the war, so it could totally fire. So we do kind of need to like end this war as soon as we get one of these two forts down. But for now, let's take a break here. We'll wrap this war up in the next episode. Thanks for watching everyone. See you soon.